There you go. Woo woo! First screw of construction. <sighs> Finally! What do you think? Alright, let's do it. Okay. I'm gonna put the floor in. Wow. That already makes it so solid. Mm -hmm. I did better that time. All right. All right. Floor support board number one, two, and three are in. Now we just have to put some XPS panels over there and over there. And then we cover it with plywood. Does it need to be totally flush? Um, yeah. We'll just cut different ones to make it all fit. Alright. Yeah. It's perfectly. Oh, good. <laughs> okay. Looking good. I think I got some... I got some stickies out there. That's okay. Don't mess this up, Lou. Got it. <laughs> okay. First cut. We didn't even Damn. have to do any alterations. Wow. We have a floor. Yeah. That's cool. Wow. I was not expecting that for you. No. <laughs> I was like, why are we filming this? <laughs> you never know, Dina. You never yeah. know. Yeah. Cool. Let's measure the next one. You don't want to screw this in? No, we have to spray the foam. Oh, out. yeah. halfway because it expands. Do you want it in there or no? Yeah, if you can. Whoa! Really does go crazy. Good job, Dana. Thanks. First time using spray foam. Yeah, it's weird. It's kind of like crazy whipped cream. Yeah, it kind of reminds me of that stuff we were never allowed to eat, the marshmallow stuff. With cream? No, the marshmallow thing. Oh, before. fluff? Yeah. You weren't allowed to eat fluff? No. Okay. Wow. Well, like, of course. Eat anything I want. Pretty good, I have to 
it say? Oh, what a relief. Take a walk on it. We're finally building. Yeah. Feels really good. Huh. It's fun. I'm learning how to use power tools. Next up, we get started on the walls. Today? <laughs> Don't worry. Not today. <laughs> Tomorrow. Going in. I'm gonna get this place all gross. Oh, Dana, your shoes. I know, I just told you that. <laughs> the foam is exploding everything. No, don't show that. Everyone's gonna be like, you did it all wrong. Well, this is how we did it. Can't say it's the right way, but how it went in. Right? Yeah. What did Should we do wrong? Well, you're only supposed to fill it halfway. It's hard to do that, though. Yeah. Oh, it's sticky everywhere. Oh, it's dropping. Ready? I am ready. All right. Dynamic duo is here. We're on our way to work. We're on our way to work. Hi, hi, oh, no. hi, hi. He's very excited. Hi, yeah. He hasn't gotten exercise. Sit, today. sit. Good luck with sit. Good boy. Oh, good boy. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Oh, you're very, you're very excited. Yeah. Oh, yes. Oh, yeah. Hi. Uh -huh. yeah. <laughs> friend. Hi. Today you're on leash. Yeah, because we don't want you running away again, do we? That's a lot of love. You got a lot of love. All right, to your trees. Okay. To your trees. Okay. Sticks and rocks. Sorry, you're getting tied up today. You chill here, okay? Ah! Now we work. Alright, insulation. Isn't he the cutest? Now, let's see what's going on in here. Ah, oh, Lou. The game continues. Is it the er, Rebby? Mm -hmm. Oh, look how far I've come! Okay, new beams on the side. Mm -hmm. So today we're gonna try to finish all the insulation. Yeah. It's a lot of work, I don't know. We'll see.
tell me when it's kind of bright. Okay, so we just got all the studs in um, to prepare to put our insulation in, and so I thought I would let you know what kind we got. Lou found us something called Thermo Jute, which is a natural fiber, and it is mold and it's mold resistant. It is naturally mold resistant. It is fire resistant and it doesn't off gas, which is really nice because most of the insulation options out there, including like the spray foam that we just put in, are like really toxic. And so we wanted to put as much non-toxic materials into the van since like once, even once the walls are sealed, we're just breathing this air. And so that was our plan. So we're going to try out this jute and hopefully it works. So we're gonna cut it to perfect size, use some spray glue, and then put in our plywood walls to seal it in. Yeah, so it's like not a perfectly non-toxic build, but at least this part is. Yeah, we, I mean, we're trying to limit the amount of excess chemicals that we need to have because it's such a closed space, you know, there's not much ventilation. We just tried to save one of our vents and built this like window frame around it because we were like, should we seal over it? It'll be easier, but then we're like, we should probably have some air circulation in this van, so we left it. All right, let's do it. Blah, it's so bright. Ooh, so let's cut this open. Carry this all the way from Germany. Can you believe that? Hmm. Yeah, you don't like need anything special to use it either. It doesn't irritate the skin or anything. But. Do, 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 do. It's like the red carpet, but it's brown and made of natural fibers. Kind of feels like a wool blanket, but less itchy. Mm -hmm. Just plants. <laughs> Nap time? <laughs> kind of smells. It is that kind of nap time. Oh, yes. It is that nap time. How cool will it be when there's a bed here and I can actually just take a nap? You're yeah, gonna be napping all the time. Woo! We ran out of kombucha a while ago. I was just thinking that. Oh man. Any kombucha companies wanna hit us up with a? Oh yeah, this one actually. Calm Vita. I should write to them. It's yummy and it's from Spain. And that's some free kombucha. I want this more. More please. Cool that you can just cut it with scissors. Yeah. I'm covered in this stuff. Dinner? Yeah. How's it going? Great, I got the window in. Oh, amazing. I got my drawing in. Drew, yeah. the child that turned out is very pretty. <laughs> Different proportions. <sighs> wow, babe, you made it look so pretty. You like it? Yeah. Did you find the piece? Take a look. Wow, you made it look so good. How did you make it look so good? I went like this for like half an hour with the sander, so oh, everything. Oh, it's so good. Cool, right? Yeah, it's amazing. I think it's really nice. And it's it like, looks like really good. I love the rounded edges. Yeah, that was kind of like I could have gotten it straight, but then I was like. No, the then rounded just, looks great. It kind of reminds me of like a boat window. Yeah, totally. Alright. 
Oh, I like it a lot. Oh. It makes it feel real. <clears throat> Look at that eat? wall, yeah. Ah, <sighs> oh, you brought dinner. I brought dinner. Oh. Ah, <sighs> oh, baby. You did Isn't it. it cool? Yeah. Thank you. Uh huh. Good thing I made us all this food yesterday. Isn't it so nice? Mm hmm. Mmm. Ooh, we got the new kind of miso. Yeah. Too. Taste it. And tomatoes. Yum. I'm gonna just pause. Are you filming? Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Dinner for Lou and for Dana, or Lou for Lou and for Dana. They're the same. We got tomatoes, sauerkraut, miso. Mm -hmm. What's miso? You know what miso is. Miso is a fermented soybean paste that's really salty and yummy. Mm. And what's this weird stuff over here? We have nooch. This is natto miso, which is, I don't really know exactly. It's like a miso made out of rice or something. The person at the health food store said I would really like it. And then we have rice and potatoes. Right. It looks very light out, but it's already actually six o'clock. All right, dinner and then work. And then we keep going? Yeah. All right, I hope it fits. Oh, please. Dun, 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 dun. Oh. Wow. That. Close her up. All right. What happened today, Dana? Well, we got this wall in, but the only way we were able to work on the van is to actually drive down the mountain towards town, kind of like more towards the coast because it is raining again up where we are, which is annoying, but we realized that we can't just keep waiting out the rain. We have to like make a new plan. So we are now commuting to the build, which is kind of fun. It's like going to work. We came down the mountain, found this random parking lot and no one bothered us. So it seems like it's totally fine for us to work here. And we got in this, finished this wall, got in this wall and yeah, it all takes like a little longer than we were expecting because there's so many like little cutouts you have to make, whether it's like a wheel tire or this window or over here we have like a place where the water comes out. But yeah, I think this is going to work out really well. We can just avoid the rain, come down here and get a little time away from the cottage. But sad, we'll miss the donkeys. But that's it for today and do this again tomorrow. parking lot day three or four I don't really know we've got way more walls up look at this we've got windows coming through and our goal for today is to finish the whole front so we have to put a wall in because we want to separate the front driving area from the back living area and we don't know how to do that yet so we have to figure out what we we're gonna measure where we're gonna put the studs in and I really hope that we can get a lot done today Come on. Out. 
So we'll do one from here to here times two. So one there, one there, and then we'll put studs in between the two. Okay. And it will be nice, hopefully. Should we get back to this window? Mm -hmm. oh. Well, this installation makes a nice little resting spot. This is like Spider-Man. Look at that, Dana. Can you believe it? Our walls are coming in. It's starting to look like a real home in here. Yeah. So we do that wall, uh huh, and then we go home. Yes, and then tomorrow we finish that. That wall. And maybe more. You're crushing it today, babe. All right, do in three, two, one. Looks nice. Shall we put that board in? Yeah. All right, our van is looking better. Woo! What do you think, Dana? That was a good day. Oh, big one. Big day. Yeah, but I'm really proud of us for getting in two spots. We've never done that, just had done one before. This wall looks pretty good too, I yeah. have to say. All right, so today we are gonna try and put a wall right there, but it's raining, so we'll see how working entirely inside the van works out. Screw. All right. Well, I kind of fumbled that one. <laughs> <laughs> it's okay. It doesn't matter. <laughs> Woo! We did it. Yeah. Now you see me. Now you still see me. <laughs> see you soon. Bye. You want me to get dinner warm for you? Sure. I love you. I love you. you Good work today. You and Alfie are a very cute duo. Oh, he's the best. He's very naughty, though. Gotta keep this dog chained up all the time. Bye.
All right, so this part is done, and this part needs to get done today, hopefully. So definitely. Dana says definitely. It definitely has to get done. That wall, that wall, that wall, board in there, and three more walls. Here we go. All right, so the studding is in up there, and we figured out what to do with this storage area. We've got our textile-based insulation in. We just need to put some more of that in there and then cover all of this with the very, very thin plywood. And yeah, hopefully finish today. There we go. Oh. Whatever you feel, I mess it up. You can't believe this is our last panel. Yeah. Oh. Yeah! That was the last screw for the walls. So we have officially insulated and put the walls in for the van. And I feel like it is starting to look like a home. Still messy, but like the van life experience has begun, which is really exciting. And this is a ton of work, so it feels like a huge part of the build is behind us and we're like getting to the fun stuff, like painting and building the kitchen and putting in the bed and all that good stuff that makes it truly feel like a home. And I really hope that this keeps us warm and cool when we want to be because we put in so much insulation that we're really hoping that it helps. And look at this beautiful window. Let's light in so it's not it won't be as dark back here. It's not actually as dark as I thought it would be. Yeah, right? And once we paint the walls white, I think that will bring in more light as well. So yeah, big project done and a lot more to come. Cute. Should I throw a celebratory rock with Alfie? Yeah. Let's do it. Ready? Look at all the flowers that came out, too. Yeah. Now, we should probably put in all this wood again. Yeah, just in the nick of time, because that is a thunderstorm. Are you sure? Positive. Let me give it accurate lighting. Dun, dun, dun. Thunderstorm, 100%. Wanna bet? I usually win, or I mean, usually you win when it comes to weather bets. So I'll just give it to you. <laughs> but we can bet. What do you wanna bet? Um, dinner. I'll bet you that, because I already made it. 